Hello everyone, today we have another unboxing from thecubicle.us. I have no idea what's in this package, so let's go ahead and get right into it. Okay, so in here we have the MF2S 2x2 in stickerless. Then we also have the new Moyu Magnetic Scube, also in stickerless. Okay, let's go ahead and get started with the 2x2. Okay, so straight out of the box, it's very smooth and very sandy. I'm actually really impressed with this cube. It has very good corner cutting, and it seems to be very fast. It also has these primary internals right here, so these pieces are caps. Okay, so for only $5, I'm really impressed with this puzzle. It's very fast, very smooth, and it really has excellent corner cutting. Let's go ahead and get onto the cube. Now, I'm very excited for this puzzle. Okay, let's go ahead and do some first turns. So similarly to the magnetic pyramid that Moyu just came out with, the clicks are very subtle when you're turning fast, but if you turn slow, it feels similar to a wall bearing and it clicks into place very nicely. Also straight out of the box, it is much, much faster than the original Moyu Scube and it is much smoother due to the magnets and the lack of ball bearings. So this was Moyu's first Scube on the left here, and as you can see, this Scube is a bit bigger than the new one, and I really like the new size. My main right now is the GE Scube, and the Moyu appears to be a tiny bit smaller than this one also. Overall, I'm very impressed with the quality of these two puzzles. Now, starting off with the 2x2, two two, it's only $5, and for such a cheap price, you are getting very high quality performance. This thing is super fast, it doesn't even lock up that much, and it has a sandy smooth feeling straight out of the box. So if that sandy smooth feeling is something that you prefer, I think this would be a great option for someone who's looking to buy a brand new 2x2, two two, or someone who's trying to get into 2x2 two two and wants a entry level cube. Now in terms of the Scube, this is by far Moyu's best Scube. Now their old one was very good, but this is considerably better. Now one thing to note is that it's very lightweight. It's lighter than a lot of 3x3s that are coming out these days. So if the lightweight feel and the small size are something you would enjoy in a Scube, I'd say this is very worthwhile to pick up. Another thing to note is that when you're turning very fast on this puzzle, it's very hard to feel the actual clicks of the magnets. So if you preferred a skew that didn't have ball bearings in the past, then this might be the skew for you. I will have links to buy these puzzles from thecubicle.us in the description below. So thank you so much to thecubicle.us for sending me these puzzles to test out. I will definitely be making reviews of both of them in the future. So that's just about all I have for this video. Thanks for watching guys. Bye.